Hey, here's today's tip to help you be prepared for an emergency situation. Enjoy! In this video, I will show you how to build a rock shelter in seven easy steps. A rock shelter is an overnight survival shelter with a fireplace to be used in the winter and severely cold weather. When building a rock shelter, you are looking to use a large rock wall, giant boulder or cliff face. Incorporating rock into a survival shelter is excellent as it reflects heat and magnifies the effects of a fire, helping to keep you safe and warm. The following example is a lean-to and is one of the best overnight shelters you can build. A rock wall lean-to with a fire can be large enough to accommodate up to five people and be extremely warm. However, it does require relatively large logs to construct, so it is more labour intensive than, say, a wiki-up shelter. These tools will help. I've put some links in the description for you. So to build a rock wall lean-to with a fire, follow these steps. Step 1. Find a rock wall, cliff face or large boulder. If necessary, clear any moss and debris from the front to expose the bare rock. Step 2. Build low walls. Using logs stacked log cabin style, build three walls against the rock, creating a clear rectangular space. Build the walls about two feet high. Step 3. Lay out the interior. Clear an area and use rocks to build a half circle hearth against the rock face. Use branches, leaves, mosses or debris to add bedding to the floor, leaving a space for the fire. Step 4. Add roof framing. Using long poles or logs, frame the roof. Lay the poles or logs leaning at a 45 degree angle against the rock wall. Then rest the bottom end on the log wall and make a row of leaning poles to frame the roof. Step 5. Cover the roof. If you have a tarp, cover the leaning structure with the tarp, leaving a gap above the fire to create a chimney. If you don't have a tarp, cover the frame with leafy branches. Step 6. Cover the sides. Use your tarp or more branches to cover the sides, leaving an opening to act as a doorway and to provide air intake for the fire. Step 7. Insulate the structure. Use branches, leaves, moss or forest debris to insulate the outside of the shelter. Pay special attention to plugging up any gaps in your log walls to block out the wind. If you have snow, adding snow to the outside of your shelter will provide excellent insulation too. Think like a yo-yo survivor and be prepared for when you're on your own. And watch this survival video next to learn more. And share this video with your family and friends too, so they can be smart and be ready in case of an unexpected survival situation. Stay safe!